This one is uh, probably type of fresh water ice. Hello everyone, this is Kevin from 2 and Solution. If you have a problem, cannot use the GDAO in Python 3, like the couldn't install on Python 3 terminal, or even you couldn't import GDAO merge function in order for stacking or combine one single image from original Hyperion data? Here is a solution. So this is the Earth Engine data catalog for Earth observing one Hyperion hyperspectral imager available from 2001 and 2017. On the Google Earth Engine website, so describe exact wavelength range from band 8 to 224 two on the Google Earth Engine editor. This is a basic simple code, western part of Greenland. So there's a two option, draw a shape or rectangle with only one single sentence for de define variable data set dot medium dot clip bracket open close geometry however right here side go to the task So ready to go the learning. The title of a uh, name of a file. Just to put the default. Oh, we wanna save as a Google Drive. Once it's ready, click to learn. In this time, I just what I did. Go to the tab click the layer and uh, add the layer then add the last uh, on the symbology and uh, click so you can see all like the 220 band data is ready to load so red is the 50 Green is a 23. The last one is a blue. It's a 15. So we should be scroll up. And apply and click. So now you have a post color composite image from Hyperion data. So last one, I would like to introduce how to look over the value on quick GIS. So just to click the icon identified features. This one is uh, probably type of a fresh water ice. The two value is very similar, but technically from spectroscopy, like the spectral library, natural reflectance of a cloud cover a little bit higher than that of those from freshwater eyes. Please leave your comment as below. Please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and the light to my post to motivate the better and better YouTube video in the future. Thank you very much. Have a nice day. See you soon. Bye bye.